The next speaker is Andy Pollock. Good morning, Kathy. Good morning, everyone. So I'm going to keep my comments brief this morning because Murray went over his time. But Kathy, I just got a brief question this morning, and hopefully maybe you'll bring it up in the presentation. Um, we have a federal holiday coming up. We know Memorial Day is a week from today, and we know that we're going to be running the weekend schedule. But uh, keep in mind, and I want to bring this up to everyone's attention, because some people may be getting an extra three-day weekend in June. We have the weekend of Juneteenth, and I was wondering if the Long Island Railroad, along with Metro North, maybe New York City Transit as well could be in this equation. Is there going to be a weekend schedule on Monday, June 20th? Because I'm looking everywhere. I didn't see anything about it in the committee books. And keep in mind, the New York Stock Exchange is going to be closed. The post office is going to be closed on that Monday. So uh, what's the MTA's policy for that Monday? Because for federally observing it, first time ever on June 20th. So that's all I'm wondering. So that's pretty much it. I have more lengthier comments for Richard Davi in the next hour. So um, that's all. Take care, everyone, and have a good Memorial Day. The next speaker will be Andy Pollock. Thank you, Kate. Good morning, everyone. And especially, I would like to wish a very good morning to the new president of New York City Transit, Richard Davi. Richard, welcome back to New York. I know you spent some time up in Boston, and I noticed that there were couple good things you did with the MBTA up there. And I will like to mention that there are challenges that are facing us here in New York City. First of all, Passengers United would like to give our condolences to the family of Daniel Enriquez, a very unfortunate incident that happened yesterday afternoon at Canal Street. And I especially would hope that President Davi is going to address the crime that we are facing with our transit system. And I want to mention that one of the things with the subway action plan, uh, Mayor Adams claimed that there was going to be no more sleeping allowed on the subway. Well, guess what I encountered on the E train last week? That's right. Somebody's sleeping between Jackson Heights, Roosevelt, and Queens Plaza. So... A lot's got to change. Um, also, there are staffing issues that need to be addressed. Um, we see constant problems with that. The subways are running very slow on the weekends. Passengers United has been getting numerous complaints about that. And, you know, overall, we're hoping for a better transit system with Richard Davi. Let's give him a chance and let's see what he does. So, Richard and everyone, have a good Memorial Day, and I expect to speak to you all again in June. Take care. 